I attended a lecture by a professor at Wheaton College. His name is Gary Berg. And I have several videos explaining how wrong he was on so many issues. He uses his supposed New Testament scholarship to basically bash Israel and Jews, uh, pretending to be a scholar. His one verse that he used about the Old Testament was completely erroneous and out of context, and he neglects some very basic New Testament verses to further his cause. But that's not the main issue for this video. The main issue is that Wheaton College should just know that the guy is against free speech. He was complaining a lot about the Christians United for Israel Zionist group and their evangelical perspective, which is his right. And then he said he's fighting to keep the Christians United for Israel group off, not being allowed to have a student voice on campus, to be a student group. Why? Because then he said in this lecture at the First Presbyterian Church of Wheaton on uh, September 28th, in the morning of the lecture that I attended, that he doesn't want them to have a, be a student group because student groups can invite outside speakers and they might invite somebody like John Hagee who's the head of Christians United for Israel he doesn't want John Hagee on that campus so here's a guy who gets a forum supposedly teaching New Testament and has no credentials on the Middle East but goes around lecturing like he's some kind of expert and lies and lies and lies in my opinion and based on the facts that I know but he wants to keep another evangelical preachers voice off the campus because he doesn't obviously want to have anybody challenging his the stuff that I think is nonsense coming out of his mouth so Wheaton College should just know that this guy is against free speech and the reason he's trying to keep the Christians United for Israel group not to have a, a student voice is because he's afraid of the speakers they'll bring in which will challenge his severe anti-Jewish anti-Israel views